sun will be up soon and we're out on the boat now today today we're going out we're going to check a few pots first while it's early then we're going to go off and try and catch some mackerel and maybe a, a few bass is that all we need? Is that what we need to go fishing for today? I think so. Eh? Well, and then any unusual species. Any unusual species? So anything extremely unusual, we're always out to try and fish for. And we may do some bream fishing. I haven't decided on that one yet. We'll we'll, we'll see. The trouble with today is a trouble. I say the trouble. It's quite funny. This. this is the funniest. This is the funny part, right? It's completely flat, and that's the problem. Most people are like yay. But it's not great for, for trying to catch bass and things when it's so flat. You always want a little bit of movement. But we'll find out. We're out there. It doesn't always go that way. Sometimes you can catch quite well. So we'll see when we get out there. I think there's a bit of a swell. Well, it doesn't look like it. But when the tide comes up, we'll probably see it. So. Right, let's get going. Right, are you almost ready to cast off? Because I'm ready to go. Right, we're lifting the first pots of the morning. Two we laid here the other day. We haven't potted here for a long time, so I thought I'd stick a pot here, see what we get. If we get. Here it comes. A big male in here and there's a female i'm wondering if the male's gone in for the female so if that's the case we might just leave that in for one drop just to see if another male would go in because they can sense them when they're gonna yeah. breed so might be worth a try we'll only do it for the one drop there. Yeah. anyway we've got one nice lobster nice male one That's nice that, it's good size that. It's not massive, but it's it's within our range that one. Look at the claws on it. It's a beaut. Let's hold it up the other way a bit. The other way. That's it. Yeah, nice. That's alright. Yeah. Yep. That should be the size limit, I reckon, about about that size. It's just nice that. Large. And that one is probably just under. Well, I'm going to say it's under. Well, I don't think yeah, that one's under. Thank you. 
Fish for Becca, just other mackerel. Uh, I don't know actually. Oh, it's normal. Well, I say normal, it's not bad. Not bad at all, actually. It's got bigger, isn't yeah. it? Yes. Unlike the lobster, it gets smaller. Look at that beauty. Yeah. It's a nice cool. one, that. One of the better sizes this year. They go mental when they've just been caught bass. They're just like so lively. They thrash around like crazy, even on the boat for a while. That's why we normally let them rest for a bit. And as I'll get you with their gill rakers and their fins. That's a nice fish, that one. Best one in the morning so far. See, I, something hit it then, but then it didn't hook again. It's the weight that's hooking. Oh, here's a pollock. Right with the hook. Yeah, you go. Look at that beauty. Yeah. Lovely Please big pollock. That. Yeah. Giant it's a silver mackerel. Yeah, I won't give it a bit longer though. Oh, we can walk to some kind of rock. I'm going to have to move this off. Mind that's the same clump we just saw a minute ago. Very similar. I wonder if that's like... The shoals of fish, maybe. Oh, look at the size of him! Okay. Look at him! Look at him! Look at him! Little babby! Baby green! <laughs> what a little cutie that is! It's not very big, but... Or just, you know... It's not just hooked a small fish. It's been a while. It's been a minute. It has. It's been sitting waiting a long for a fish minute. for ages. Just saying how calm it that's was. That's all the way, that's fine. Mm. This is there a it is. Here it comes. Yay! Fish. It's been a very really dry last hour or something. Half hour. But I got a mackerel. Normal size one. You get a bite, so sir. You get a bite? No. Um, I was definitely getting bites. Yeah, we are just in a bit. I was going to say, I was getting bites. She stole my fish, she did! I was getting lots of bites and now they've stopped. And she's got a fish. What does that say? She stole my fish. I saw her. She moved her line across. I saw it. Yes, I saw it. It was there. She moved it across right where my fish was. What you caught, Chuck? Well, yeah, definitely my fish. There it is. Definitely, see, it's got Troy written on it. <laughs> nice. It is mackerel down there. There's a few mackerel just pecking away at the bait. What, what do you reckon it is? Pollock. Do you need the landing net? Do you need the gaff? Do you need the gaff out? We get the gaff out. Gaff. Gift gaff. 
It looks massive. But is it? Or well, it's pretty, it's sizable. Sizable and it's a big mackerel. Ooh, nice. Nice big mackerel, that one. Yeah. Big ground mackerel, that. Nice. Yeah. Loving that. Yeah, we all like a good mackerel. Especially when you've invested in a mackerel to catch a mackerel. So something interesting, you reckon? Gurnard, maybe? Yeah. I don't know, it was slack line of me. It was really weird. It wasn't like your, your normal sort of fish bites, you know? Like, it just kept slack lining, slack lining, then I saw the bite. So I struck it. Oh, it's one of them. Oh. <laughs> one of them. One of them. The old doggy. We got away, we're not getting one yesterday though. We got one today though, make up for it. Okay. Still. They're so strong, even, high, yeah. even for a little fish. There we go, straight down. And the salty sand deal again. Inside. And the last pot today. I mean, there is quite a nice edge of rock there, so. I think there were some holes and some lobsters that went in it. Here it comes, and it's here. Yeah, it's only a little one, but it's shrinking all the time. I know someone we had the other day, look. Oh, yeah. We have a caught this one the other day. Yeah, the other broken claws shows they go back in the pots all the time, the same ones. Let them go. Again. We'll be back again the next time, probably.